I think what's been great about this meeting is the f there's been many things. One aspect is the format that the organisers uh, have decided to, to, to try out here and it's been one of the few meetings that I've gone to that has, has used that format. So let me just say what that, that is. That's essentially um, what, what the organisers, CRUK, Cancer Research UK, as well as, well as Richard Gilbertson, who's the, the, the chief organiser of this conference, um, asked us to, to do as speakers and as chairs is to really focus, maybe using our own research, to highlight examples but not to give a traditional talk, to talk more about what are the challenges in brain tumour research, in uh, advancing uh, studies from the lab to the clinic, for example, um, and how do we overcome those challenges and where are the opportunities. And w in terms of the topics that have been picked for the various different sessions, often these are, are maybe groups of people that don't necessarily you know, talk with each other. I mean, of course, we all talk with each other, but don't work together. And so brain tumour research, like many other aspects of cancer research, has been quite siloed. And what has been uh, really great about this meeting over the last three days is that uh, there's been many opportunities because of the degree of discussion, because it's panel discussion, you don't have questions after each individual talk. It really facilitates you know, different, uh, discussing different opinions, different takes on the data, different takes on the clinical uh, trial results. Um, but also going forward makes us think, you know, really take a step back and think about what, what are we trying to do here? What are the key questions? How can we uh, address them? How can we take uh, ideas and, and principles from other, other disciplines, right? So for example, here we've had sessions on uh, how, uh, you know, neural development per se, how, how, how can some of the principles for, for, for that be potentially important, uh, be, be hijacked as it were in the context of cancer, the same applies to the immune system. We had a session this morning on the blood-brain barrier, uh, the importance of understanding the cell biology of the blood-brain barrier uh, as a means to improve drug delivery. That's a, a question that impacts every, uh, every tenant of, of brain tumour research and, and clinical application. So again, bringing together groups of people that wouldn't necessarily find each other and as a consequence of that, you know, we're, we're already finding multiple different ways to to continue talking, to start collaborating, to maybe think about applying for grants together, that unquestionably would not have happened without this type of forum. So I think in that respect it's really been a phenomenal success and something that Cancer Research UK is, is, is clearly going to apply to other disease types as well.